I can pr no. Grandpa Newbie reporting for duty with a look back with fond memories in my heart for the Black Ops 6 beta. I can't wait. 32 more days as of this recording to go. And I already did a video on the XMG, but one thing I didn't say, the XMG is super cheese. I mean, it puts out the bullets and you can gack people through cover. So if you just stand back and gack through cover... It's going to happen. Now, there's my configuration. I'm not going to go through it in detail. There's a wonderful photo of myself included. You can screenshot that, print it up, and hang it behind your gaming station for inspiration. But configuration is going to change, no doubt about it. Once you rank up the weapon in start looking good to me, Black Ops 6. Like I said, 32 more days to go, but you're going to see Grandpa on this map just shooting through cover, cheesing people, not having to tweak at all to get the gax on this one. There you go. Just a bullet hose, a fast bullet hose. And... It acts more like an assault rifle than it does an LMG. I think the closest thing to it might be the new cast-off LSW, maybe the TAC Evolver, but the cast-off LSW, if properly configured, is just like this one here in terms of the way it feels. But I Grandpa's taking a risk by going in the tag. middle. He rarely did that because you can't cheese as easily, but what you can do... Of course, it's not as fast as the LSW. What you can do is get a tag, and those tags are important for two reasons. Number one, so your team will win. That's the most important reason. But number two, so you can climb your team's leaderboard. That's important, too. Grandpa never said that he doesn't like to win and come in first. And I'm just cheesing. Look at there. I'll show in slow motion, just cheesing through the curtains there. Didn't know anybody was there. Two of us. That's that's absolutely disgusting. That is so dirty. And I mean dirty not in a good way. That guy's sliding around, but what he doesn't know is Grandpa's going to cheese him. Look at him. Look at him. <laughs> uh, he's diving sideways. He gets a big hunk of goita right in the gourd. I goited his gourd with that cheesy shot there. So Grandpa doesn't often use LMGs. He did when I was first learning to play COD. The LMG seemed to be the easiest weapon to use because you didn't have to reload and you can just keep your finger down. And hopefully, look at there, cheesing. I'm looking for the cheese. There's some more cheese right there. That's, that's worth a slow-mo. See him right there? And now we're cheesing. I don't even know if that's the same guy. There might have been somebody laying down thinking they're safe. Oh my gosh. What do you think? This is almost embarrassing to show you. But in my defense, I wanted to make a video that just showed the cheese of the LMG. Look how big those bullets are. I believe they're 50 caliber. Look at that. Long shot in that tight map that's one thing about the maps there's some more cheese there one thing i like about the maps in black ops 6 is you'll be able to get your camo grinds because just about every one i think there was one that i didn't get a long shot on and i'm including these kind of face-off maps here this is a face-off map all right let's see if we can cheese that guy grandpa's dropping the cheddar how about that Okay, that's not cheese. If you use a pistol, it's not cheese. Well, maybe not every time. But that is just, it's just ridiculous. Okay, we won that one. Grandpa held the trigger down. Got a bunch of, what, tags. Good job, Laney.
chat monitor is right. active. Well, let's get some more cheese here. I started out with the holographic site, but this one here I think is better. I'm hunting, hunting the Swiss, making the holes myself on the Swiss cheese. Standing in the back there in a power position with this weapon, you're untouchable. You I, I, I tell you, no. oh, there's another pistol shot. On all the maps, this weapon was a tough one to go up against, especially guys using steroids, but uh, even the guys not using them, this was a tough one to go up against because it seemed to ADS fairly quickly. It shoots straight. It shoots fast. It shoots through things. And it gacks people. I'm lying on my back there. So I have a few Black Ops 6 files, some content that I didn't use. And I specifically didn't use it because I know that I would grow when fond memories of the beta so i'd want to revisit that a few times and this is one of those times i also have i think some xm4 files and maybe some aims some content for that let me know in the comments if you enjoy being reminded that we're only 32 days out we're just about a month out from the release of black ops 6. It's going to be a pretty exciting time. A lot of things to learn. I'm working on uh, all the settings on the on the controller. So that video will be out probably in the first week or two of Black Ops 6. It's pretty complex. But it's all the settings. All the settings explained and recommendations. See if there's any more cheese out there. I saw... Uh, there was some cheddar. Ooh, a guy tried to beat Grandpa today. Yeah, they're not going to beat Grandpa. I saw some cheddar. I saw some Swiss. Saw some baby Swiss, even. Looking for more cheese. So I was on the hunt for the cheese. Things broken. For a final push. Hope you left some in the tank. I don't know if I was teamed up with some subs on this one. Kind of embarrassing. Uh, if they saw me cheesing so much. But like I said, this was intentional. I wanted to show that this gun will put out the cheddar. I give what I get. So if you're enjoying this, like and subscribe is appreciated. It helps me, helps the family. If you're looking forward to Black Ops 6, leave a comment. Leave a comment no matter what. If you have one, always enjoy the comments. Tell me what your favorite weapon was in Black Ops 6. Oh, we lost that one. But I'll see you tomorrow. Cheers and peace to you.